Ellie Norris and today we will be making brownie cakes. The ingredients you will be needing are one box of brownie mix, um, one fourth cup of water, you will need one third cup of vegetable oil, you will be needing one egg, powdered sugar, a spatula, and a big mixing bowl. And the last thing you will be needing are three different size bowls. This is what you'll be baking your brownies in. So, first, what we will be doing is we will set the oven to 325. Bake 325, and then you click start so it will be preheating while you bake the um while you make the batter for the brownies. Next, we will be putting all the ingredients into the mixing bowl. So first, you put your um, your brownie mix into the bowl slowly so it doesn't all powder out and spill everywhere. All that stuff is out, and then you throw that away. Next, you you want to put your egg in because if it accidentally gets a shell in there, then you don't have to scrummage through all that oil and water. So then you crack your egg. Next, you will want to put the oil in. Then you want to put that in the sink. Then you want to pour the water in. And then last, you want to put the brownie syrup in. So then you want to squeeze that out of the bag. You want to make sure that you get all the chocolate in to the batter. So you want to like layer it so you squeeze all of it out. And then you just stir it until it turns out to be a dark brown mixture. 
Once you get a dark brown mix like this, you want to go around the bowl and skim the bottom to make sure there's no more batter at the bottom. And once you have your batter like this, you will want to see all those lumps, you want to get those out. So you kind of want to smush them up against the base of the bowl. And get all those light, the brownie batter, all mixed in with all the ingredients. And once you have all that done, you will want to make sure you have all the bumps out and skin it. And then what you'll want to do is you take your, your biggest bowl. Huh? Half. Half. You want to fill the bowl halfway up with the brownie batter. You want to do this slowly so you don't get too much. And you want to check it. That's about almost halfway. You know what? That's good. And then what you want to do is you put that aside. And that was the timer going off that it has preheated. And then you want to fill this one about halfway full. Make sure you got it all flattened out. And then, finally, you'll do your little bowl and do that same as these halfway full. Since you have some extra batter, you want to, this one isn't quite full, so you want to put a little bit more in. To this one. If you don't have it already full. I'm only doing this because I didn't get it all in there. About halfway. And then, as you see, I can I still have some extra batter. So maybe what I want to do is um, get a another small little bowl, and this will just be your munch on, say. Um, Don't pour that in there. So. Later. So once you have all these in there and all halfway full, then you'll want to stick them in the oven for about 20 minutes and check on them. You want to stick them in the middle of the oven. Be very
very careful that you don't burn yourself. taken them out of the oven and we've let them cool as you can see I've cut the tops off of the brownies so they would lay flat so now what we're gonna do is we're going to take our shifter and put a spoon full of powdered, powdered sugar put this in here and just go like this I'm going to shift this around and then put this over here. So then once you've, you did this, then what you're going to do is you're going to take your uh, medium piece, you're going to take your frosting and just spread a little bit around this on the bottom so that this is kind of the glue that will make this all stick. See like this. And then you just take it and you just center it on here. Okay? So next what you want to do is you want to take your shifter again and just shift it like this. And then you'll do the same thing with your top piece. Take some frosting. And it's a little too much. And, and spread this on here. Like so. And then you'll do the same thing. Center it. Then you'll do your powdered sugar again. See? And that is how you make a delicious brownie cake. 